welcome to the Fairy Tales and Cocktail Show. I'm Nilsa, and today's episode is an emergency, urgent message for twin flames and separation. This is a message for somebody who's probably asked a question, are they still down for me? Am I a cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs, right? Are you a cuckoo puff? This was too beautiful not to share, so here it is. These came out together. I swear on my life, these came out together. The Emperor, okay? This is clarifying, like, is this person my divine masculine? The Hierophant. This is an awakened masculine, followed by the Empress, which is you. Nine of Pentacles. And Princess of Wands. They see you as the best of the best. The song that comes to mind is um, Whitney Houston. I'm every woman. She's all in me. Anything I want done, baby, I do it naturally, right? They love your intellect, but they see you as and it doesn't matter what your style is. You could be urban, punk rock, gothic, vintage, doesn't matter. The point is how high they see you. They see you as the ultimate woman. If this isn't resonating for you, then this isn't your reading here. They wanna spoil you, okay? They want to take you on a proper date, so this is why, like, the little emperor is all dressed up in a suit and tie, and you have, like, you're getting ready here, and your vanity mirror with your jewelry and everything. So if you're questioning, okay, I have no communication, do they even like me? Yes, they do, okay? Then over here, um, we have the chariot and then we have six of cups six of cups comes out a lot for twin flame dynamics because you or your eternal lovers that have been together before so this is going towards union we have ace of wands here which is a new beginning we have knight of swords this is like urgent communication ace of cups gift of love this is somebody racing in to give an offer. Could even be um, a confession. But they're, they're gonna say, this is definitely for those of you like um, who kind of feel like your masculine is awakened and you don't have any proof yet, but you feel it on the inside. Yes, they know who you are. Yes, they want this new beginning. Yes, they want to rush in and give you this gift of love. So I also feel like this next part is beautiful and like super important to some of you. Um, I'm going to list out the things in their hands because I feel like a lot of these symbols are significant and will resonate. We have bubbles. We have balloons like the movie Up. We have a watering can. And we have like a Valentine's Day gift box. So if any of those feel like they're significant and I'm feeling like it is I'm I'm feeling like the shadow I don't know if you can see there the shadow behind him is important that's what it feels like it's like the it's the only shadow showing up in the pictures that's important for some of you okay so we have some of you growing a business here and if you've needed their help or they're already successful, this is them helping you. But they want you to know um, they've been working. You see how this grass here is really low? 
and in this picture it's covered almost up it almost looks like it's raising up um this is a repeating message that like the you know the future fathers here have been saving up that green and then all this snow here is like purity there's not a lot of footprints in the snow that means he's just kind of starting um going forward but what is he going to right what is, what is this romance going to we have success and marriage so it looks and this is like family here like this whole thing feels like a surprise proposal and if it doesn't feel right but it's a hoping inside like oh i hope that message is for me it might not be for you because i'm not trying to tell you what you want to hear but this came out too beautiful like what <laughs> so i just wanted to share it before i put it away because i have this uh, it was like this urgency to share it like i feel like somebody really 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 needs it and it could be for one person watching or two people but it it felt like because i'm like i tell people the best way to describe it is like i'm like a messenger I'm like, um, like a bridge. I'm just bringing their message to you, like a satellite. And I feel like to not deliver a message would be slapping God in the face. So. Hold on, they want me to pull. Mm. I was hearing what else, what else? So some of you watching are like, all right, but just give me a little more. And I just pulled some random cards from the back. We have choice they did already make their choice and we have jealousy you're getting jealous over nothing because they already chose you we have ambition dedication and we have the sight they're gonna move forward they're dedicated to you they already chose you you're jealous over nothing and this is the sight this is any divine feminines watching I know, or it could be masculine i suppose that is intuitive so you already know you're looking for clarification just to humor just to like humor God here Let me shuffle these in too just to humor God I can grab a random one here you can't go back to yesterday be in the present stop holding things against people from um, from the past Choices came out again. Are you kidding me? I already shuffled that back in. Choices came out again. They already chose you. Like We have 37, which I know who that's relevant for. Nature communication, elemental messages, flower energies. Somebody's getting flowers. Somebody's getting flowers. We're on Valentine's Day. Some of you, you're getting flowers, you're getting an apology, you're getting communication, you're getting um, a proposal. Could be a key. I almost see like a box. You open the box and boom, there's your key inside to move in. Okay, I feel like that's enough for a lot of you. What's this? Words. If you're thinking... I was just gonna say, if you're thinking, okay, how do I trust this girl? We have words and entitlement. I feel, why do these keep popping out? Why do these keep popping out? We have sacrifice. We have a clear solution.
what I'm getting is you have to let go of control a little bit and listen to messages. This is not the first time you're hearing this message. It's not the first time you're hearing this message. So what they're telling me is you have to kind of stop trying to fight people you, you feel like you're resonating with and it's almost like you're yelling. Like you could be on Instagram, YouTube, whatever, and you're like, well, they're wrong. Well, that's not this. Well, that's not me. Blah, blah, blah. You're like fighting, fighting, fighting. And this is telling you, you need to shut up because somebody already gave you the answer. Somebody already told you what to do. This is Lantern Fairy, a clear solution. Somebody already gave you the answers. They already gave you the light. Shut the fork up. That's all that means. I'm going to stop pulling because I have to leave. Stop being so bitter right now. You want to prove you got it. Shut up. <laughs> if you did resonate with this video, give it a thumbs up. If you're a new subscriber, hit the notification bell and click the word all so you can always and forever get my messages when they come up. Thank you for tuning in to the Fairy Tales and Cocktail Show. See you in my next episode.